Hello students, this is J Science Hub. Today we are going to study about how the heart works. The function of heart is a little bit complex because both sides of the heart work simultaneously. So, in order to get a deep understanding about the function, I'm going to explain you by a step-by-step -step process which take place in heart circulation. So, Let's start our journey from lungs. Lungs is a purifier. It means it's oxygenating the blood. After oxygenation takes place, the oxygenated blood has to bring back to the heart. So the pulmonary vein, which starts from lungs, brings back the oxygenated blood to the left atrium of the heart. At this time, the left atrium is in a relaxed state. After oxygenated blood is pumped into the left atrium, it contracts. The left ventricle is relaxed simultaneously. So the oxygenated blood from left atrium is transferred to the left ventricle through the mitral valve. Later, left ventricle start to contract and push the blood through the aorta Aorta is a main artery which supplies the blood throughout the body. Aorta divided into multiple arteries and these arteries are further divided into capillaries and supplies the oxygenated blood to the cells. Cells engage in cellular respiration and the deoxygenated blood is bring back to the capillary. These capillaries join to form the veins. Veins bring back the deoxygenated blood to the heart. The main veins which bring back the deoxygenated blood to the heart are called vena cavas. They open into the right atrium. Inferior vena cava bring back the blood from the lower part of the body. The superior vena cava bring back the deoxygenated blood from the upper part of the body. At this time, the right atria is in a relaxed state. When the right atria start to contract, the right ventricle starts to relax simultaneously. So, the deoxidated blood is transferred from right atrium to the right ventricle through tricuspid valve. Later, the right ventricle starts to contract. It push the deoxidated blood flows into the pulmonary artery which flows to the lungs for purification. Like this, heart continues its cyclic function, getting the deoxygenated blood from the heart for purification to the lungs, then bring back the oxygenated blood to the heart and circulate throughout the body. Then from the cells collect the deoxygenated blood to the heart and then transfer back to the lungs for purification. Human circulatory system is considered as a double circulatory system because before it transferred to the cells, it flows out of heart twice. Here, the circulation which includes lungs is known as pulmonary circulation and the circulation of blood to the whole part of the body is known as systemic circulation. Right ventricle exerts the push for the pulmonary circulation while the left ventricle exerts the pressure for the systemic circulation. Hope you understand the function of heart. Like the video, share the video and subscribe J Science Hub for more videos.